Hey guys, Final Story is here. Before the video starts, I just want to say the, this build is going to take 5,040 metal, but this metal can also be used as brick for the black outline you guys see there. So take either 540 metal, or you can add the metal on to how much brick it's going to cost. Because brick it's going to cost 1,220, but you guys can add the brick and the metal together. Change this outline to all brick if you guys wanted to. Or you can leave it metal and brick. It's easier for me to demonstrate black outlines. I guess when I'm using a lot of brick. But yeah, it's gonna take 140 wood, two, no, 1,220 brick, and then 5,040 metal to build the Charmandel pixel art here. And you also use code Finest Stories in the shop because I do have a supporter creator code now. But that's about it. Let's get right into the video. It feels like I'm skydiving when I text you Rose petals on the floor outside your bedroom Sunshine whenever you smile at And welcome back from that With this build you can either use metal or brick for this outline Cause either way when you upgrade to tier 3 It's black so completely up to you So first you're gonna find your open area I'm using metal so it's easier to basically tell which is which I'm gonna go over and upgrade everything after So it's a lot easier so first what you're going to do is find your open area and then build four. Uh, either direction, I'm going to build it more this way just so it makes makes it easier. Make sure I don't hit anything, it should be fine. Okay, we have four and then go to your end that you're wanting the picture on, it doesn't really matter, so pick either end and then go from this three up, so one, two, three, like so. Then what you do is go up from this, so leave a gap and place another one. After this, what you're now going to do is fill this in with bricks, so like so. Just have it like this. So have like uh, three across and in the middle one up. Then you're switching back to metal. One here, and then one here. Then over. It's kind of hard to explain when I'm doing pixel arts. Because, I don't know, I'm not great at explaining when it comes to pixel arts. But yeah. You're going to do... Oh. But yeah, you're going to do that. I keep breaking it. Alright. You're just gonna have two up and then you know three like that. Well, however you want to explain it, that's how you need to do it. So now what we're gonna do is go to this end over here. We're just gonna hop up. You can just use scaffolding like this. So you just place a piece and then you just go over. But yeah, from this one piece here, you're gonna go over one, then up one, and then over one again. Then you're gonna hop back on this top piece right here. You're gonna go up another three. So one, two, three. From this, you're going to go all the way back up, so you just place another piece to keep going. Then you're going to go over one, and then up another one, so you just have two. From this point, it actually gets a lot more complicated, because what we're going to do is go and do the tails, but with this tail, we have to like swap between them to make sure we have the pieces. We're going to, you know, just going to continue with that. So from this piece, after we went through, let's go back the other way, place one piece of brick, and then on top of that brick, place a piece of metal. Then you're going to hop over and do the same thing. On this one you're going to go two up instead of like here you only went one and then one up. You're going to go two on this one so we can do the tail. Then you're going to hop on top of this. We're going to do that again. Place a piece of brick but this time we're not going that way. We're going to the left. Then we're going to go three up. So there we go. From there three. And then we're going to hop back up here. Switch to brick. And we're going to do the same thing but we're going back to the right. One, two, three. Hop back on top, and we're doing it again, still going to the right. And then from here, uh, we can literally just place it, because that was actually the tip of the tail. So from this one, you're going to go another see, brick, and then go down. And then you're just going to place another two. Like that. Drop down. And then we're going to flop back to this. We'll switch back to brick. And then we're going to go over three down. One, two, three. I'm going to give you an overview of how the tail looks before we actually finish it. So now we're going to drop to the bottom of this. Switch back to brick. And on this one, we're going to go directly under it. Just like how we have been. So one. But we're not just going to do one. We're going to go one more over. So we have two. And from here, you're going to have two more down. One, two. So you in total should have one here and three down. Now we're going to drop to the bottom of this. Use another piece of brick like so, and then go two down. So one, two, and then from here you're just gonna go one more. As you can see, we're able to connect up. 
Now what we're about to do is start filling in the tail, and then after we fill in the tail, I'll give you guys an overview of how the tail should look. So go to where the base of the tail is, like right here. I've fallen. Go to the base right here, and just fill it in all with brick. So just go through the whole tail and fill it in how you please. And after, we're going to go through, and certain pieces do need to be wood. And I'm going to show you which pieces once we fill it all in. I've fallen, and now we just need to get back up. You will f uh, fall quite often, unless you are actually good at this. Which I am d not really. <laughs> now, I may build big fix alerts like this all the time, but falling is like a big thing I do when I do this. So let's fill it all in. Break any of these extra walls if you placed it like so, like I did. After this, come to this three base line right here. So basically to the top, see where it goes. One, two, and at this third one, they click some kind of platform right here. Because this is, we're going to change to your wood. Because we're going to edit a bit into the tail. So it adds like a flame. So it's just not a solid color. So one away from it, you're going to break this one and this one. And then you're also going to break this and this. You're just going to fill all that in with wood. If you guys didn't uh, really, if I didn't explain that well, so for, you have that three, after you get right here, you're going to skip one, and then from here you're going to go one, two, then one, and then down. But I'm going to quickly break all of this right here and just give you guys a uh, back view of how it looks. So if you guys ain't looking like mine, you may need to rewatch it. So probably not explaining it amazingly. But uh, I probably will do more tutorials in the future, and I'll try to get better at explaining it with these. So this should be something with what your tail is looking like right now. Right now, it may not look like much, cause I mean, that's about what it's gonna look like, though. Kind of, it's a bit odd. But yeah, that's that should be about what your tail is looking like. So let's go ahead and head back and continue up on the body, and then we'll do the head. The Charmander is actually one of the relatively simple builds, if you guys did not know that. So all you're going to do now is get back to this point right here. From this point, see the, how we had did that, we're just going to do the same. So we're going to place one brick right there, and then a metal on top. So pretty simple. And then we're going to hop on top of that one and do the same thing, but uh, we're going to go two up. And we're just going to continue this cycle like so. And then we're going to go another two. And then one last two, and then we're going to go with one. Don't do that. Okay. You should have, uh, let's see. You should have three twos and then a one. Well, one, two, 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 and one. After this, you're going to place another brick. And then four across. So one, two, three, four. Four straight across. You can have this if you want, doesn't really matter. I'm going to break it as I go. Then right here at this last one, you're going to go down by one. And then you're just going to go down by two. Uh, what am I doing? So, go one, two. And then you're going to go back to doing one. So, one. Then after you're going to go down by three now, which is going to be like the Charmander's got like mouth nose. I don't know, but something like that. Oop, it, the build is not wanting to respond. Place a brick here, and then we go down by three. One, two, three. Now we're actually going to start curving it back in so we can end off at the other foot. So we're going to place a brick, piece of metal. This time we're going to go two over, not two down, but over. So one, two, over. Do that. Sometimes we get a. Don't follow what I'm doing now, I'm just getting back up. Okay. Now that we have our two over, we're going to go three over now. One down and three over. So one, two, three. Then right here, uh, in the middle of the three, the middle dot, go down by two. And then right below this uh, second one, you're going to place one brick. And then to the left and the right of the brick, you're going to place metal. Not brick, but metal. 
Then we're going to drop below the brick and place another piece. And then two more to the right. And that should end off and connect everything. So you should come out to have something looking somewhat like this. We're about to change a couple parts and then add in its arms and eyes and we're going to add its belly and then I'm going to show you just what to upgrade exactly. All the metal will be upgraded to tier 3 and that's really all that really needs to be upgraded. But yeah, I mean there's a bit of other pieces for like white but... So now what we're going to do is start adding in the wood to make a little platform. So right here at this point where there's three and you just end it off, go ahead and get your wood out and then build two. And then two up. So you should have a four by four square. Then on this second one here, well the first one, however you want to say it, go up by one. So there we go. And then we're going to go up over here and then do the same thing. So one, two, three up from this one. And then what we're going to do is go up one more and then go up by two like that and this is going to be Charmander's stomach right here so you should have something for the stomach looking like that it's like a stair kind of but it goes two three three two pretty simple now we're actually going to do Charmander's arm and then we're just going to start filling in everything and I'm going to show you where his eyes is so right here on top of this what you're going to do is place the metal and then one more across then you're going to come to this three one the first three and then place another piece of metal and then you just fill in the arm right here. You're just going to place two pieces of brick. And then you're going to place a piece of metal. So this is what you have right now. You have like an arm sort of and all that. So now what we're going to do is go put in his eye. Then after we put in the eye, we're just going to fill it all in. And then after we fill it in, I'm just going to show you the certain pieces that you're wanting to upgrade to white. And then that's about it. Because... All you have to do is upgrade your metal to black, which is tier 3. So, let's see where we're going. Going right here. At this intersection where there's 3. Let me hop back up. Right here, where there was 3 and then 2 down in the center. We're going to come to the very edge of this. Get our brick. Go 2 up. Hop on top of those 2. And then we're going to place 3 pieces of metal. 1, 2, 3. And don't do it right here on the edge. Don't do it in the center. So right here on the very ledge of the three. Go up by two and then three metal. And to the left of the metal, place two uh, more metal. Like that. And then do this. Which that's going to be the eye when we eventually upgrade it. So this is what you should have. You can already see it starting to look like Charmander kind of. I mean kind of not, but they kind of at the same time. But alright, all the left, uh, everything that's left right here, we're just going to now fill in with brick just so we can finish it all off. So let's go do that. Alright, now that you've filled in your whole Charmander, you should have it looking like this. You can leave it like this if you want, but uh, that's not what we're going to do. So what we're going to do, uh, these two bottom pieces, we're just going to run up to it. This piece and this piece are going to be upgraded to white because this is its toes. Got a little tone of runes there. Yeah. That's his toes basically, so those two pieces are going to be upgraded to white. Then that one piece right there is also going to be upgraded to white because it's like its hand. So we're going to do that. So we have one more piece to upgrade to white, then all the metal is going to be upgraded to tier 3, which is black. The last piece is that uh, one piece in between all that metal up there. So what we're going to do is just build up there. So you go up like this, just build it all the way to the top so you're up there. Which I am here, so this one piece between all the metal, you're just going to upgrade it to white. Then after, you're just going to break all this down. Grab a piece. Yeah. After you break it all down, this is what your charm should look like. The green outline will be changed to black, which I'm about to do. So, let's go and upgrade the outline and then see our finished product. That's it. The build is done. But with this build, if you guys want to see more pixel arts like this, tell me down below. And I can get more pixel arts like this out, or I can continue doing the standard building tutorials I have been doing. But either way, thank you guys for watching. This is Finestorios, logging off. See you guys next time for another video. Bye, guys.